Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to my winter wonderland and snow plowing simulator. As per usual, it's snowing out here, which is a good thing for me because that's how I earn money. And yeah, today we're going to earn a lot of it. Let's actually check the weather. Oh, great. It's going to be thundering today. Fantastic. Uh, we got packed powder out there. How does it know what kind of snow is dropping? This is one intelligent weather meter or whatever the hell these things are called. Anyways, today is a good day because look at that. We unlocked the plow in the last episode. Have not used this thing yet. Gotta be honest, I don't think we're gonna get much use out of it for most of the jobs because as we have saw, we're clearing a lot of paths and whatnot. Uh, but we do actually have some jobs on the map on the left side we haven't really done yet. We have did a lot of the ones around us, as you can see. And we got one over here for Major Kristup Field. So yeah, we'll go out there, do those jobs, and hopefully get deeper into the whole Yeti thing that's going on in this world. And uh, yeah, the only thing we found so far is his hair. So hopefully we can find him or something by the end of this episode. That would be great. Also, I don't have um, winter tires on my truck, so this could be interesting with a plow. All right, so we can lift and lower the plow. And then obviously, oh, that is actually really satisfying. We can just clear the road. Now, I'm not paid to clear the road, but obviously it would help with me getting around. So I'm at least going to pave a way for me to get around. Dude, that is actually really satisfying. I am impressed with the clearing physics on the road, and it's very wet and slippery underneath the snow. So that's going to be fun to deal with. So yeah, the next goal is obviously to get some decent wheels for this thing because this is not enough right now. Am I going the right way? Yeah, okay, so a lot of the jobs I haven't done are over on this side of the map. And we got our, oh god, our first one right here. Now, obviously, I will use this thing for as much as I possibly can. Why was that cleaned? All right, okay, so yeah, I think I'm, if you remember, I was breaking the game by, like, adding snow to the map. Now it looks like I'm deleting it with this once I go through the entrance. I'm not going to complain. I have duplicated so much snow in this game, so if I can clear it real quick, that is great. And that's probably all we can do with this vehicle here, at least. Because, yeah, as you can see, I mean, maybe I could... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, this is this is a really good idea. This is actually working. <laughs> and the great thing about the plow is you don't really have to deal with the mounds. Oh, hi, how's it going? Just, 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 just clearing your backyard here. Okay, I am actually hitting things, I think. Yeah, I don't think it's designed... Okay, so I think there's a curb here. That's why. Sorry, sir. Hold on here. I am... I am very lazy in this game, and I don't really want to have to do manual labor if I don't have to. So, there. <laughs> it's it's kind of working. It probably is legit faster <laughs> than me getting out and doing it myself. All right, we at least got to do this line over here. Like, look at that. That is perfect for my truck. I am so going to get this thing stuck. But, yeah, look at that. The dream right here. Oh, I am saving so much time. Dude just casually has an 1800s era wagon in his backyard. Okay, that's a little weird, but I'm not judging. Okay, he's got a freaking totem pole in his yard too. Multiple totem poles. What the hell is this place? <laughs> All right, cleared out this area. Let's talk to the weird bomber pilot here or whatever the hell this guy is. Hello? Good morning. Thank you for clearing the snow from my property. However, it's a lot of work. I can't do it alone. And this is a really charming place. What do you do, pilot? I'm an enthographer. I study the cultures and traditions of various communities. Recently, I moved here because I discovered there's a very interesting legend about a Sasquatch here. This is one of the most famous nearby legends for generations. A great unknown creature living in the mountains was told. Did you find out a lot? Dude, the, the text in this game needs some work. Some people say they saw Sasquatch with their own eyes. There are reports about a huge foot traces and mysterious sounds coming from mountain forests. However, there is no... Official scientific evidence of this creature. Do you have materials? What do you mean? Yes, I'll be happy to, uh, to order in my notes and send you everything by courier. Okay. You can't just give it to me now? Oh, wow. He already sent it to me. Okay, that 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 is that is fast. Thank you. I'm coming back to work. You have my background. Let's stay in touch. I'm going back to... I do... <laughs> this is so confusing. Well, at least we got more information on the Yeti once we get home. Can I just say how insane it is in this game that people want their whole backyards just like mowed? Like, I understand there has to be some differences between the levels. But as someone who's lived in Canada his whole life, I don't think I've ever plowed my backyard. This is just insanity. This is this is what the client wanted. We are pretty much done. We just got to do this little side area here that I missed. 
And, uh, then we'll get out of here. What the hell is that? Is this a freaking walkway for ants? That's the what I'm probably missing. <laughs> this has got to be an error. Oh, yeah, this is definitely it. This is great. Yes, here you go, with little ant pathway. And now we're at 99.8. Seriously, what the hell was that? That was clearly a glitch. Oh, the other side, yes. Ah, ha, ha, I did it. I got 100%. That might be the first time I've actually gotten 100%. Not bad, not bad at all. This client is going to be super happy. Uh-oh. Guess I didn't get 100%. All right, 15 minutes of my time well spent with packed powder. $534, not bad. And I guess I've cleared three properties of 100% snow because I just got an achievement for clearing three for 100%. All right, well, go me. I'm better than I thought. All right, we need a snowblower for this one and a snowblower for that one. So two snowblowing jobs to the far left. And I guess Ali, yeah, Ali good one was one that just came back to me. So it's still a red pin, but we can do these two as well. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to the left. I've already done these ones a lot. All right. Water drive route is not available. What did that say? Hold on. Not available for passing. You need to get recommendations first. Well, what, what street is that? I'm going to CEO Catherine Steidman's house. By the way, if they make you put CEO in their name, they're the biggest douche nozzle this side of the snowbank. So... This is probably going to be a fun job. Hello, CEO Catherine. I'm here to do your job. Oh, this isn't bad at all. Okay, we'll be able to use, obviously, my plow for this. So we'll do that. And it looks like we got a little bit of a side job as well. Where are the homes with the extremely large driveways? That's what I'm talking about, man. I'm I'm breaking the game with this thing. Oh, so yeah, it seems like as if I hit the front. Nope, that's not how it works. I thought if I hit the front entrance with it, it would clear everything in its path. But it, I don't think that's the case. What the heck? Oh, am I supposed to actually clear the roads? Okay, so that might be in reference to this road. Oh, I'm actually clearing the wrong spot. Sorry about that. I didn't realize you had a little bit of a curved driveway. I should probably assume that, judging by the fact that the garage is over there. All right, you know what? We'll go over here, too. What is that? There's something dark there. Oh, I think that's uh, a light. So we'll just clear part of this. You know what? Free of charge, I'll also do your backyard, because I pretty much guarantee I'll have to do it sooner or later. May as well start doing it now. Look at that. It's like made for me. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing we have to do back here. I love how I'm 81% done and I haven't left my vehicle. I could probably 100% this without leaving the vehicle, but I could save so much more time by just leaving the damn vehicle. So yeah, I'm thinking, just ju judging by the fact that I have the vision, I got to clear this road. So I probably will do that just to see what happens after we're done this job. And that should be the easiest 100% I've ever done. 99.2. Just got a little bit left on this side. And is that 100? There we go. That's the 100 I like to see. Uh, yeah, so it's not available for passing. You need to get recommendations first. So I don't even think I can pass this road. Two minutes. That's crazy. Uh, and $300 for that? It was not an easy job, but this is how you work with a school principal. What the hell does that even mean? I'm just plowing your snow. Why does it matter if you're a school principal or not? Well, the satisfied headmaster recommended me to his neighbor. Uh, additionally, commission roads to the school and playground field itself. Okay, so I finally get paid to clear roads. And I'm assuming this is the road here. Do not worry, children. You're going to have to be forced to go to school. No snow days on Dre's book. We're going to clear this. Ba oh, God damn it. Hold on here. All right, there we go. You know what? Maybe I should wait until I get better wheels. I mean, I could probably do that. I mean, I can definitely do this. It's just going to be a pain in the butt when it feels like I'm on ice all the time. But yeah, this is a, this is a very technical road too. All right, 35 degrees up. Oh, <laughs> at least now you can kind of see how insane the grip is. Yeah, we might need to upgrade these wheels to even get up here. Oh, wait, there's a question mark at CEO Catherine Strideman's house. We must go find out what the question mark is. Uh, by the way, I think that's kind of lame to, like... <laughs> if there's any secrets, it just pops up as a giant question mark on your map. So you obviously know there's something there. Uh, but yeah, it looks like there's something behind Catherine's house that I missed. To be fair, I didn't have to clean her backyard, so... Didn't really look around too hard. Who the frig designed this place? I just... Re wait, was that always there? What the hell is... Is this a freaking fence for ants? What the hell is that? Okay, so... Oh, it's got to be in the pool or very near to it. In the hot tub, maybe? 
Was the Yeti chilling in the hot tub? Oh my god, it's like right here. All right, well, maybe there's something on the ground. I actually don't see anything here, so... Just clear some snow around the point of interest. See if there's anything actually here. Aha! What the hell? Was that there the whole time? It turned nighttime, and now it's really glowy. Uh, found the first artifact. It will be definitely useful someday. It was not the first artifact. I have already found an artifact game. What even was it? Artifact fire. Find the artifact of fire. Why is there fire beside a hot tub and a pool? Wouldn't that be the water one? What the hell? What the hell is the point of the fire one here? All right, well, we found the artifacts. <laughs> I'm just more confused at this point. What does that have to do with the Yeti? Does it even have to do with the Yeti? I have no idea. Uh, but at least now we know. Next goal is to get tires so we can go up this crazy road over here to the north. Looks like maybe that's where the school goes. I don't know. All right, and down this road, which I don't have to clear, by the way. I'm just doing it out of the goodness of my heart. Uh, there should be the one job we haven't done yet that I've at least unlocked. Which is this house right over here. That's a big house. That's a very big house. Oh, God. Uh, I might actually get some good use out of this thing right now. Because it looks like it has a giant front entrance. Look at these mounds of snow, too. All right, let's see. Whoa, fancy opening fence thing. That was cool. And okay, yeah. That's probably the first job where I can legit just use my truck for the majority of it. And it legit be a good way to do it. Oh, God. <laughs> Dude, I'm still so slippery. Uh, well, I don't... What's my money at? Does it say anywhere? I have no idea how much... Oh, there we go. 1843. So a few more jobs and we should have what we need for the tires. I need $3,000 for the tires here. Uh, then my job will be truly easy mode because this is already pretty fast, as you can see. But yeah, I am just slipping all over the place. Okay, we do have a bit of a lip on the side of the driveway making this kind of annoying. So I might just get out and manually do the sides we are leaving a bit of snow as you can see so it doesn't delete at all but it definitely deletes the vast majority of it oh <gasps> you can drive and clear snow virtually anywhere with a tractor only plow fits it but it's sufficient enough to clear even a pitch what the hell does that even mean the tractor is equipped with standard wsd automatic transmission as always pay attention to the available features displayed at the bottom left corner when you dig yourself up with a tractor somewhere off the road and you can't get out, call roadside assistance. Okay, so the tractor is in the game. I didn't think it was because it wasn't in my uh, shop menu, but I guess it is now, maybe? I don't know why I just randomly got it doing this job, but okay. Obviously, the tractor will be nice. It's like a mini truck, and I kind of need that for the majority of these jobs. Anyways, we should be 100% done. Perfect. Perfect. Not okay, it lied. There we go. Now we're 100 percent done game. Damn it. Oh, that was a super satisfying job, too, just because of how useful the truck was. I actually felt like it was meant for that job. So there we go. How do I come on? There we go. Four minutes to do that whole job. 900 freaking dollars. Oh my god, that would have took me an hour if it was just with the hand tools. Okay, we got this job again. Uh, as you can see, there's some fresh snow as well as my old snow. I think this is obviously a very big job, but with my truck, this is pretty open. So I don't think I will need to do much without the truck. So of course I'm going to try and do this. All right, let the clearing commence. Oh yeah, this is just going to be so satisfying. I just got to drive around. That's all I really got to do. I don't even think there's like things I can hit here. Okay, so there is lights. I just got to pay attention to, but that's about it. We're already at 10% done. Oh, I, I love this truck. This truck is just so good. All right, a day later, and I think I'm pretty much done with the truck. Not bad. 90% done with just that. But yeah, this has been super satisfying. I love this thing. Just got to deal with the lines that I placed everywhere. We also got this big piece right over here. I'll probably just do with the truck. Save a little bit of time at least. And yeah, I think we're pretty much done. Let's just try and get this line. Save some time. And we'll go park this outside and do the final 10% manually. Okay, and cleaning up my truck's mistakes. This thing actually works great with the truck because these lines are super easy to clean up with it. Uh, we've got a little bit over here. Wow, we're at 98. Uh, I left actually a whole walkway over there. So that kind of shows you how big this clean was i want to try and get 100 of course we've been getting 100 this whole run so let's keep going with that 
All right, now it looks like we'll probably hit 100% right now. 99.9. .9. So really, there's actually not much room for error. That was legit just 1% of the job. That's actually crazy. Uh, so there is a bit of room for error, but not much at all. That's probably my cleanest job yet. I actually did want to do this one clean, and it looks super good. And with the size of that job, it's got to be close to another $900. What? <laughs> 2000 Holy! Uh, I thought it said I was only going to get paid 800 You have completed a special assignment on Major Krista Fields. Check the map from time to time to see more special tasks. Okay, so that was a special task. I don't know why, but now I definitely have enough money to get those chain tires so we can actually clear some roads as well. So let's go do that. Okay, let's also see what's new in the store because there was... Okay, so we do... No, sorry, that's the same snowblower I have. Sorry, I thought that was a snowblower as well. Um, it does, there is mention of a new snowblower, so I don't know how you get that one. And I don't know how you get the freaking tractor plow because I just had a, a mention of it, but this is still locked. I thought it might have been that. It doesn't look like it. Mind you, I don't really care. I would prefer having my truck, but it would be nice to have a tractor. Anyways, big purchase here. We're getting the chain tires and it's in delivery. Ah, there we go. Uh, oh, that's the freaking... Okay, I got the shipment from the guy. Uh, so that's that. Now, where's my tires, though? Oh, do you want to put on new tires chains to the vehicle pickup truck? Yes, I would love to. Thank you. Oh, do we got some chains on it? Yes, we do. Chain tires. Now we should be able to deal with that giant hill. All right, this might be too much now. Before, I was sliding all over the place. Check this out. Like, dead... It's it's shaking my truck a little too much. But yeah, I sure as hell got grip now. All right, I finally feel like a real snow plow man. And we're on the hill again. The one that kind of beat me before. And that was right here where I struggled. You can see where I ended. Kind of see a little bit of a difference now. As you can see, it pays to get upgrades, I guess. Don't worry, kids. You're going to school. No snow days for you, big jerks. Why does that school look like a damn prison? What the hell is, is, is that? Is that a school? Okay, yeah, there's there's a playground. Dude, there's like... Why is there so many gates? It looks like a legit prison. All right, bit of an update. Yeah, having a hard time getting the last little bit because I keep building those little lines. But obviously, the snow always goes to the right of my car. So slowly, I've been pushing it far, further and further to the right. Um... Yeah, we're at 99. I don't even know where to hand this in. I would like to get 100%, but with how big this road is, I don't know. But yeah, I've always handed in my jobs at mailboxes. Last I checked, roads don't have those. So I don't know if I have to go to like the street sign or what to get paid. Or if I even get paid. I truly have no idea. Maybe this just un unlocks the school. I don't know. All right, yeah, the only real errors is at the edge of the uh, roadway now right here. So that should be the majority of it. I don't even know. Can I? Okay, I can use my snowblower on the roadway. I couldn't if it wasn't a job, but it looks like I can for a job. I wonder if I just grab it from here, do you think? I have to snow off the access roads first. Okay, so yeah, this is one water drive. And once I get this road done, this clearly unlocks this. All right, we should actually... Yeah, we yeah, we got the big 100%. Where the hell do I I submit this? Well, it's clearly not over here, so it's maybe at the road sign? That's the only thing I can really think of. Aha! I, I was totally right. There we go. Do you want to pass the job? You have cleared the snow 100 in 14 minutes. Yes, I would like to pass the job. And somehow I only got paid $543 for that, yet the job I just did before that was $2,000. I guess that was a special job, though. All right, now it's time to clear the snow from the pitch itself. Is that like a name for a school or is that something else? All right, guys, but I think it's a good time to wrap up this episode here. I'm probably going to wait a little while until the next episode because I am coming to this game early as per usual. And they have a lot of things planned that they still are very much developing. They actually give you a, a nice list here. I don't know if I showed this yet, but... Uh, really cool to see this. They can they even show the progress of their work and uh, how long until these things are going to be done. Very excited about the new truck. We get pickup tools too, whatever that means. Uh, fuel's going to be a thing. Tire wear is going to be a thing. Tool wear is going to be a thing. 
Uh, so yeah, I definitely want to slow down a little bit and wait for the game to actually be uh, updated quite a bit. That might be a year from now. I don't know. But yeah, obviously when the game gets updated a little bit, we'll be checking out again and going deeper into this game. And yeah, hopefully we can find the Yeti by the end of it. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. As always, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.